Festa Italiana is underway this weekend on Milwaukee's lakefront. One of the big highlights, as always, is the food. Rosella Rago, host of Cooking with Nona, is here. She is doing a demo at 6 o'clock tonight at Festa. Rosella, it's great to have you back here Thank on Live you. at Daybreak. And who have you brought with you today? This is Nonna Lina Palladino. Say hello. Hi. Hi, hello. Well, good morning and welcome good. to you. As part of your TV show, you always have Nonna or a Nonna, a grandmother, yes. on with you. Uh, what are we making today? Today we are doing uh, a Calabrese favorite of Nonna Lina because she is from Calabria, right? Si, yes. And we're doing a beautiful zucchini parmigiana. Have you ever had this before? I haven't, no. You've never had this? I don't think so. He's never had this. Oh my gosh, you missed something. Well, very good. Uh -huh. very we're good. ready today. Okay, so we did most of the work here. Okay. You know, we were slaving away last night. I went to her house, it was beautiful. And uh, we just start with some fried zucchini. Fried zucchini, I cut the zucchini, I wash it, I cut it, I cut it, and then I fry. No, one, no, I love your accent. <laughs> one minute, and one, is way, one minute in another way, and then in extra virgin olive oil, always. And then we make a sauce. We're using a sauce made with beautiful red gold tomatoes. These tomatoes come right from Indiana, right next door, so they are local. And uh, canned tomatoes are actually better than fresh tomatoes because they're picked at the height of their freshness. Not a lot of people know that. I did not, I did not realize uh -huh. that. So a uh, secret to making a good tomato sauce is what? Well, so I fry the onions. You fry the onions? Onions and garlic. Okay, fried so onions and garlic, and garlic with the tomatoes. And then when the onions eat a little bit soft, I put the tomato. When you're doing the zucchini slices, mm -hmm. how thick do you want to cut your zucchini? A quarter inch. Quarter inch. Quarter inch. Not, quarter too, inch. not too thick and not too thin because uh, they will thin out just slightly in the oil, so you don't want them to break. You want them to have a little bit of a... a a little bit of thickness so they hold up okay. because see what we're doing? We're doing our last layer and we did one one way, we're doing one the other way and that's going to reinforce, you know, it's what's all at, about... What's at the bottom? At the bottom it's layers of sauce and then zucchini and uh, mm. sauce, cheeses and then zucchini and then you just keep repeating. So it's a little bit like a lasagna with zucchini. Like, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone loves lasagna. Yes, yes, see, yes. but this is something called cucina povera. Do you know what that means? No. That is the poor kitchen of the south and cucina povera uh, is peasant food. So, if lasagna was something that you would eat on a holiday or something, it was very expensive to make because there would be meat, there would be expensive cheeses sure. in it. So this is something that farmers could make on the regular because they were growing zucchini. Actually, Lena got these zucchini from her friend's garden from next door. From my friend, my neighbor. Well, it looks delicious. <laughs> yes. And uh, is yeah. this the recipe you're doing today? Yes, yes. we are going to be making this tonight. So you can come learn how to make this with Rosella and Nona this afternoon, this evening at 6 o'clock down at Festa Italiana. Thanks, ladies, so much for coming to see Thank us this morning. Thank you so much. Now, now you're going to eat, right? Now we're going to eat <laughs> during the commercial break. It's going to be delicious. Festa runs 11.30 to 11 tonight. It costs $13 to get in. Free for kids under 12. If you'd like more information, just head to our website, tmj4.com slash links.